through customs. The CSEC office may have more information. You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here ten years ago. Yes? My associate is trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drell here. There we go. One of my men reported a drell recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse? Ah, uh, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. Duct rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, selling illegal VI personalities. Actually, he was selling one of you. Me? Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say I delete data like you on the way to real errors. Buggy, though, it crashed every half hour. The error message was about how the galaxy was at stake and you should fix the problem yourself. What was it you called, Mouse? The duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Aren't the ducks dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, suffocated by vacuum exposure. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the keepers run. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. I've heard enough. Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. You should pick up a copy of the Shepard VI when you talk to him. It sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. You don't know us, Captain. Why are you going so far to help us? I've worked Zakara for two years. Every day kids turn to crime because they've got no other choice, because their parents don't care. You're trying to save yours. He faces a dark path. We better hurry then. You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans to assassinate someone. He's a cop. He tried to stop Kolyat and one of them could end up dead. I don't want that. Yes, of course. Thank you, Shepard.
Yeah, yeah, I can get that. No problem. Well, yeah, sure. I can get you two cases by the end of the day. You mouse? What are you... Oh, shit. Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. What do you want with me? Be still, Mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. How do you know Thane? Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same Mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. They're everywhere, see everything. Yet they are never seen. You gave another Drell instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I didn't ask. Because the people I work for? We don't have time for this. Oh, oh God. Thane, help me. Help me, Mouse. My son is out there, in the dark. That's why I carried for him. I thought you'd want me to. Please. Explain. He, he came in, said he was looking for work. He had a hollow of me, the, the one you took, Krios. I put the word out. Use your old contacts. Elias wanted to hire him. Elias Kellum. One other thing. That Shepard VI you're selling? Oh shit, you heard... Look, you were dead. It was totally legal to make a VI of you. Give me a copy, we'll call it even. What? I mean, sure, yeah, absolutely. Sorry about the whole... Just so you know, there's three Volus who are patching it all the time. Tell me about Kellum. Human. Moved to the Citadel about ten years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. He got big after the Geth attack. Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in the big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shin Akiba. He's seriously bad news. I didn't want to do that, Mouse. We just don't have much time. Just go away, man. Mouse, I'm sorry too. Just go. That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees. Bare feet black. A dead end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then. But I left him, as I left Kolyat. Mouse said you had a hollow of him. Yes. A foolish bit of sentimentality. I can perfectly recall every moment I spent with Mouse. He pulls at my arm. Smiles. He wants to know that I'll remember him. That anyone will remember him. I take the hollow. He smiles at himself in miniature on my palm. Then a frown crinkles his brow. He pats my pockets, checking for other hollows. Where's your son, Krios, he asks. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. I wish they still made role-playing games like they used to. These days, it's all big choices and visceral combat. Yes? Can we talk about my associate's son? 
You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Oh, shit. Uh, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the C-Sec charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. He pays you off. You were eager to help us before. What about now? Is it too inconvenient? I said I'd help. It's just there'll be repercussions if I don't handle it right. He and I give each other space. It keeps the peace. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. We've got Kellum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Bet Elias has his VI set to page him if c -Sec gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? You talk to him. Appeal to his self-interest. I'll put the screws to him if he needs it. Very well. I'll pretend to be on his side. But if we waste too much time negotiating, Bailey won't be able to stall Kellum's advocate. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. The hell are you two? Bailey has nothing to do with this. We just want a few answers. Off the record. Off the record in a C-Sec interrogation room? Sure. You hired an assassin. Who do you want dead? I want to see my advocate. Your advocate hasn't arrived. We're trying to find him. I'm not saying a damn word until he's here. You two are in way over. Pay here. attention, Mr. Kellum. That wasn't a good idea, kid. That is gonna cost you. Control your temper. We want him to talk. Sorry. My associate gets a little excited during interrogations. Hit me again, asshole. Every bunch is another credit. That works for me. No! Do you know what I'll do to you when I get out of here? Keep it up, tough guy. You'll leave in a bag. Go to hell. He's up. He's no use to us dead. Are we done here? Because I got people to see. I'm done being patient. Give me a name or I'll cut your balls off and sell them to a Krogan. Joram! Joram Talid. Dorian in the 800 blocks. He's unconscious. No need to wake him up, I think. He'll wake up with a headache. No permanent damage. We have Kolyat's target. Let's get to Talid before he does. Agreed. What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. Are things so bad that people can openly campaign as anti-human? You haven't heard what the aliens have been saying? They think the Council died because our fleet refused to save them that we stack the new council with humans and yes-men. Anderson does his best to be diplomatic, but they act like we're jackbooted thugs enforcing a coup. If a majority votes for him, like it or not, that's how the system works. That's a nice ideal, Shepard. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir.
There he is. How do you want to play this? Follow to lead on the maintenance cat box. Tell me what he's doing. The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. Where will you be? The darkest corner with the best view. I'm on Kira, Lord of Hunters. Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass, grant me forgiveness. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on Election Day. You can count on it. Show the humans they won't get their way. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on Election Day. Looks like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of Cole yet? No. I'm moving to another position. Ahead of him. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. Guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. I'm relocating to the next room. Let me know if anything changes. Target in sight. No sign of trouble. What's wrong? Where is he now? He's meeting a couple of mercenaries. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Also a possibility. There are obstructions ahead. I'll try to go around. Don't lose him. You're running for office. Lots of people watch you. Yes, sir. for this. I'm following. I've got him. Oh, 
Juliet! Vane, oh, <laughs> I saw. He's heading to Khalid's apartment. Do whatever you want. c -Sec. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need your... <laughs> what the hell? Khalid, get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Your father doesn't have much time left, Paul, yet. He's trying to make up for his mistakes. What? So you came to get my forgiveness? So you can die in peace or something? I came to grant you peace. You're angry because I wasn't there when your mother died. You weren't there when she was alive. Why should you be there when she died? Your mother. They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the Deep, I went to find them. The Trigger Men. The Ringleaders. I hurt them. Eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were... older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Colyet, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. Boys, take Colyat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. You're doing them a favor, Bailey. Thanks. Yeah, well, send me a Christmas card or something. I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. been in there a while. Uh, the kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSEC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. Ten years is a long time. Whoever was responsible for that probably doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, I guess you're right about that. How'd it go? Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. I watched those guys shaking down businesses and threatening humans. But he can't just get away with it. The kid wants to make a difference. Give him community service. Community service for attempted murder? What jury would agree to that? None that I've seen. This would need to stay out of the judiciary. Strictly within CSEC. Interesting. I'll think about it. Thank you, Captain.
need something. Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. If you don't mind my saying, you don't really seem like an assassin. You've spent too much time fighting thugs who think custom-painted armor makes them professionals. The Hanar trained my body for this role since I was six years old. You've been killing since you were six? Of course not. I didn't make my first kill until I was twelve. They were training me. I was not to be used and thrown away. I was an investment. You were a child, not an investment. I've given you the wrong idea. They valued me, yes, as a resource, but also as a person. They regretted their need for me. The Hanar? Excessively polite, worship the Protheans? They don't seem the type who'd train assassins. Every species trains assassins. The Hanar are only unusual in that they need other species to do the killing for them. They have a strong grip and natural toxins, but... Have you ever seen one move quickly outside of water? Or fire a gun? Why did your parents agree to this? The agreement was made under the Compact. It was an honor for our family. The Compact? We live on the Hanar homeworld because they rescued us, some of us, from extinction. We owe them our lives. That is the Compact. What exactly are the terms of the Compact? There are many things the Hanar can't do, even with mechanical aid. They ask Drell to assist them. This can't be legal. They made your whole race into slaves. Don't insult me, Shepard. Anyone can refuse to serve. Few do. We owe our existence to the Hanar. We are proud to repay the debt. The way you describe it, the Hanar sound like weaklings. Out here, they are. But if you could see them in the encompassing, the oceans of Kaje, you would see them differently. The stream of silver in the dark, looping, diving. So fast the eye can't follow. Laughter like the squeals of a child fighting as the water. They fly over the black of the sea dead like birds, plumed with the light of heaven. Why was your race going extinct? Overpopulation. That must sound trite to you. Humans developed mass effect drive before the problem became acute. Our homeworld, Rakana, had few resources. We hadn't even developed fusion power when the soil began to fail from overuse and pollution. The Hanar found us a century ago. They sent hundreds of ships, evacuated thousands of us. Billions more had to be left behind. What's the state of Rakana now? Do you read your philosophers? A man named Thomas Hobbes. When all the world is overcharged with inhabitants, then the last remedy of all is war, which provideth for every man by victory or death. As Rakana died around them, my people slaughtered each other for mouthfuls of water, crumbs of food. But you don't kill for the Hanar anymore. You're freelance. What changed? I was asleep for a long time, yes. I paid no attention to what my body was asked to do, but then... Laser dot trembles on the skull. One finger twitch. He dies. Then, the smell of spice on the spring wind. Sunset-colored eyes, defiant in the scope. The laser dances away. My apologies. Drell slip into memory so easily. Was that one of your assassinations? Uh, yes. Perhaps we can discuss it later. I've wasted too much of your time. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in Talk the to you later. I'll be here if you need me. Hey. What's happening? You got a lot of questions, don't you? 
I should go. Yeah, you should. Job, Joker. Doing my best. The wind's gusting to 500 kph. But there's a second ship alongside the Reaper. It's not transmitting any IFF, but the radar paints its silhouette as gap. I guess we know why the science team stopped reporting in. What just happened? The Reaper's mass effect fields are still active. We just passed inside their envelope. Eye of the hurricane, huh? Exploring an abandoned area, expecting something mechanical and nasty to jump out at any moment. Just like old times. What just happened? The Reaper put up kinetic barriers. I don't think we can get through from our side. You've got to be kidding me. We'll have to take down the barrier generators from in here. Any idea where they are? At the moment of activation, I detected a heat spike in what is likely the Rex Mass Effect core, sending the coordinates now. Be advised, this core is also maintaining the Reaper's altitude. So when we take the barriers down to escape, the wreck falls into the planet core. And that means everyone dies. Yeah, I got it. If any helmsman can pull us off this thing before it reaches crush depth, it's you. We'll make a sweep for survivors and recover what data we can. Stand by. Aye, aye. Good hunting. Keep sharp and check targets. There may be friendlies left. You're married? You never mentioned that. Katie had anger management issues. When my brother got married, the best man tried to hit on her. She kicked him down the church steps. A what? Katie's my wife. I must have told you this story. No, I know my wife. I remember that. 
that day was the only time I saw her wear stockings. Yeah, the, the kind with seams up the back. That's what I remember, too. What the hell is this? How can we remember the same thing? Reaper was messing with their heads. Oh! <laughs> 
I've seen things like this before. On Eden Prime. See how the room is arranged? They treated this thing like some kind of altar. You're saying they wanted to be... to have this done to them? You heard the logs. They were seeing things, hearing things. They were being indoctrinated. How you holding up? Five by five, sir. Bad memories. It's not a problem. Our sniper. What kind of Geth talks? Knows your name. Since when do Geth operate alone? They are smarter than
should slow him down.
something done with that Geth. It's still intact. Leave it. No way that reaches the Normandy. <laughs> Kelly said no one's ever captured a Geth intact. Quarians know not to try. You sure about this? There's no time for a debate. Move out. Hang on, folks. Open the port side airlock. Salvage we recovered. For now, we've stored it in Edie's AI core. We need better equipment to fight the Reapers. An intact Geth would be invaluable to Cerberus's cyber weapons division. We'll have to disagree on that, ma'am. I saw enough of these things I need in Prime. Space it. Cerberus has a long standing cash bounty for an intact Geth. I assure you, the reward is significant. I want to know why it has a piece of N7 armor strapped to its chest. Battle trophy, maybe? Would a machine care about that? No. Trophies imply emotions that AIs don't have. I doubt it's more than a convenient field repair. I've killed hundreds of these things, but I've never had a chance to talk to one. This one tried to communicate with us. Hell, it probably saved our lives. Why? Reactivating the Geth is a risk. If you do so, it should be for humanity's best interests, and not your curiosity. I still think our best interests involve an airlock. I'm not deciding one way or the other until I know what we've got here. I want to start it up. Interrogate it. If we activate it, there is no guarantee we can deactivate it again. Bullets can. That's not what I... Thank you, both of you, for your recommendations. I've made my decision. Tally's gonna freak when she hears about this. So what about this Reaper IFF? I have determined how to integrate it with our systems. However, the device is Reaper technology. It is important we test it thoroughly before attempting the Omega-4 relay. It will take some time to properly integrate it with our own systems. Are we talking hours or days? Impossible to say. The technology is complex. The crew will begin work immediately. Okay. Until then, we keep building our team. I'll let you know when the IFF is ready for shakedown. 